Well, that certainly didn't take long. Once the current monkeypox outbreak spread to the U.S., it was only a matter of time before conspiracy theories about this outbreak began spreading as well. And it was only a matter of time before such conspiracy theories began mentioning Bill Gates, the Microsoft co-founder and billionaire philanthropist. All of this should be about as surprising as a cat fight or a here's why you suck speech on a reality TV show. After all, consider how many different Bill Gates related conspiracy theories have emerged ever since the COVID-19 coronavirus pandemic began in early 2020, some of which I covered for Forbes back in April 2020. For example, there was that Gates placing microchips in COVID-19 vaccines to track everyone for who knows why conspiracy theory that people shared on Facebook and smartphones, two things that ironically do actually track people. Some politicians have further fueled such theories by either not denouncing them or even propagating them. Speaking of politicians, take a wild guess as to which congressperson has been among those pushing some of the latest monkeypox and Gates conspiracy theories in a space laser-like manner. Here's a hint, her name rhymes with our jury mailer B. Yes, take a look what Rep. Marjorie Taylor Greene, Republican Georgia, said on Thursday's edition of her Facebook Live show MTG Live Whoa, that's certainly a live one. Throughout the video Taylor Green made a number of claims about the outbreak without providing that little thing called evidence. For example, she claimed that Bill Gates is very concerned about monkeypox because this is something, apparently, he can make a lot of money off of. Him and his other buddies. She then talked about disgusting pictures of monkeypox lesions, saying that they're going to have pictures of all of these kind of terrifying images. They're going to show children with this all over their faces. And of course, they're going to be from. I don't know where they are going to be from. Taylor Green didn't specify who they might be.